So in recent news, we have started seeing more and more videos emerge over the past month regarding Ukrainian use of their MiG-29s and Su-27s to shoot down Russian drones and cruise missiles. Very interesting, right? Well, stay tuned, subscribe and leave a like, and I'll tell you all about it in this video. Just over one month ago, near the city of Vinnytsia, a Ukrainian MiG-29 successfully intercepted a Kamikaze drone, which basically is a cruise missile with a propeller. However, due to being in such close proximity of the drone's explosion, debris hit the aircraft and the pilot was forced to eject. Which technically means that the Shayad 136 scored a kill on a Ukrainian MiG-29. Next up was October 22nd, where there were a few different interceptions. Firstly, a MiG-29 fires an R-60 and you can clearly see the missile making a sharp left turn before exploding. Some sources say this is a kill, but I believe it's a missile malfunction. Why? Well, the pilot isn't leading the missile towards the target, and there isn't any debris in the sky or detonation of the cruise missile's warhead. If you don't believe me, check out this video of a cruise missile getting shot down. You can clearly see the massive fireball. Later that day, a second missile was downed over the Nistrovsky district, with its remains falling in a lake in Odessa. On November 19th, last Saturday, a Su-27 was seen chasing a cruise missile in the Odessa region. This was probably one of the 70 Ha-101s launched by two 160s and 295s, or 16 3M54 calibers fired that day. On the 5th of October, MiG-29s from the 204th Tactical Aviation Brigade of the Ukrainian Air Force claimed to have shot down three Iranian UAVs. In the early days of the war, Ukrainian fighter pilots were taught using simulators on how to intercept Russian cruise missiles. And finally, we've started to see their training in action. Now, if you're interested in more of the Ukrainian war and like my videos, you'd love to watch this video on the usage of unguided rockets in the conflict. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.